So with every iPhone out there, there's always some random storage issues that can always happen. And I've had so many storage issues the whole duration of my time owning an iOS device. So there's a few things I'd recommend doing. The easiest ways that I typically go ahead and save the most amount of storage on my device is typically by spending a lot of time in my general settings, specifically for my iPhone storage. So hop inside of your settings application on your phone. You want to scroll down until you see general, which is right here. And you want to find iPhone storage. So what you're going to want to do is click on iPhone storage and you will see this little panel. Now this panel will tell you exactly how much storage you have and as well as what takes up the most amount of storage on your device. So you can see right here, we have our little like iPhone storage option right here, which just shows how much storage we have left on our device. But right below this, it will actually go ahead and give us a little option of basically seeing how much storage each individual application is saving or using. Now, the thing I would recommend everyone that I typically will tell is that there's no point in just going through your apps and seeing the most used or least used apps and deleting them because sometimes they can be such small, even like deleting photos and videos, those things don't even take up that much storage. So the best thing you can do in my opinion is going right into this little panel right here and basically just seeing exactly what apps are taking up the most amount of storage. If there's an application that's taking up a massive amount of storage, the best thing you could probably do is just deleting those apps. So just find the app that you want to go ahead and delete and essentially use the biggest ones as an example. So you can see COD for me takes up like the most amount of storage. So what I would do is just go ahead and just delete these apps if I'm no longer using them. Now if you're using them, that's different. But just go through and basically find the ones that are taking up the most amount of storage within this panel and then delete them. A big, big thing that I see all the time is something like this, an iOS update that's actually downloaded. And this panel will actually tell you that. So what you can do here is you can just click on the specific app just like this. And what you can do, and it's not an app, it's an, I, it's an iOS update. And what you can do is just click delete update. So what you're going to do here, click delete update, click delete update. And what that's going to do is it's going to just delete the update. And then you'll also see some other apps here that you can delete, like these ones that you're no longer using. So those are ones that I probably recommend deleting the most. You also have these other ones like pages and numbers that are just like built-in stock apps that you pretty much no longer need. And then once those are deleted, you're pretty much good to go. Now what you can always do is within your photos app, you can also delete duplicate photos and videos. This is another big thing that I've seen recently on iOS 16, it's a big, big feature. So what you can do is go inside of your device settings like this or your photo settings. You can find the duplicates option. And all you're going to want to do here is basically if there's duplicates, just go ahead and either click merge or you can select all of them and just delete all the duplicates. That's another thing that I've done time and time again. And all you're going to have to do here is either click merge or you can delete the photos. And that's another thing you can try doing too. I've done this so many times and that's probably the other thing I'd recommend doing too. So those are probably the easiest ways I'd recommend going through and deleting the you know massive amounts of you know apps and storage that you have on your device in order to save more storage on your device. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.